Hello, welcome to my channel. My name is Aziza. I'm reading today for the sign of Libra for love and relationship for the month of March 2020. Dear Libra, it seems like that you are, you did apply for divorce from someone or someone like you know, in a relationship with you, like you know that they applied for a divorce themselves because it says here like you know it depends like you no know, male or female. Um, for female women like you no, know, it sounds like you know that you want to let go like you know, your past here. And because you met with someone new and you are so much in love with someone new. Um, it looks to me that you wanted this person like to be with you from the past. You wanted to be with them. And you were like, you know, you love them so much. And now like, you know, it's the time like, you know, for you to let go. Um, but someone from your past like, you know, did approach you already to come back to you. But you feel like, you know, that you gave your heart to someone else. Maybe it's too late for you or something like that. Um, this actual person, like, you know, a father of your children, and um, it could go, like, you know, for a man or a woman, a male or female, and um, it sounds like, you know, they don't trust you at this time. You did not trust them either. It has been, like, a long-term relationship before, and this person, like, you know, they do really understand, like, you know, or feel that they did you wrong and they want to come back to you because they still like to feel the love for you. They want you to open your heart and they want to be happy with you again. Before in the past they let you go because they wanted like you no know, really to have some of them like you know they had affairs. Like you know they had an affair and they wanted to be like you know with the just like you know, to have fun and a good time because there was like you know just um What's going on between you two that you were mad, angry in the past, you were unhappy. And that person like you no know, did not understand you and they could not really understand the, the way you are reaching out for things or being unhappy at that time. So they wanted to go to their actual fun. Now they feel their own mistakes and they don't want to connect like you no know, with the other people. So they are coming back to you and they want to succeed with you. Right now, like, you know, they are feeling that I let go others, uh, please, like, you know, forgive me, and I want, uh, I want to be with you. But yet, like, you know, you don't trust it. For some of you, you are taking someone from your past back, yes. For some of you, like, you know, you feel like, no, I don't want to connect with the past because I have been hurt a lot, and I try to connect with someone from my past to beg them to come back to me. Uh, I, I was loving them so much, but they ignored me back then, and I get hurt really very badly. So you don't want to go with it. Right now, you opened your heart for a new love. And it sounds to be that, you know, this love, like, you know, have been a few months ago. You felt like, you know, this is an actual relationship that you want to be with. So you are connecting with this person, and you want really to go on with it. What's happening at this time here that... Uh, the connection with this actual person, like, you know, that uh, the, the person, the, the new love, you had, like, you know, misunderstanding and issue of trust also. You wasn't really connecting very much before, and you had a problem with each other. So you tried to come back to each other again, and now you did. 
and you feel like you're extremely happy with you met with this person you felt like you're really great you felt like you know this is an actual person because it was internet connection before and now you met with each other in person you felt an actual commitment here an actual like you no know, love an actual like you no know, understanding you felt really great about you and this person so you feel like you know, that you want to be with them you see the light you know about this new relationship and it looks to me that there is an actual commitment with this person this person wants you to be with with him or her like you know in in commitment and you are thinking about marrying this person some of you like you know that uh, this uh, person like you know away or it could be like you know abroad it could be like you know a, a long term like you know a, a long distant relationship some of you like you know some people like you know being locked up in in jail or something and you made like you know arranged visitation to this person you felt like you know that when you were around each other maybe holding each other hugging kissing you felt this is a great beautiful connection so this person like you know have been really like you know just there for you they want you and now after like you know they met with you in person for the first time for some of you it looks to me that you know this person see the light like you know this is this is a true love and you feel the true love you feel that excitement in you and you want to go for it you want to actually marry this person i see you, i see you visiting this person again like you know in a short time um, you're going to be busy like you know between back and forth like you know to visit this person because if other people like you know, being like locked up in jail like you know it's, it has to be your effort from your part this person approach, approaching you uh, for real you i see you happy right now you still like to have that issue of trust you need to let go of your anger and your jealousy because if you want to be happy you have to empty you have to let go a lot you know you cannot keep like you know really being like you know just uh, watching their step because this is going to cause cause you problems along the run and you should have like you know just learned from uh, past relationships uh, that if you, when you used to doubt yourself it did not work for you eventually or very well so you have to pay attention for yourself what you are doing and I get here let go of jealousy because this person like you know, into you they are happy with you they are attracted to you they see like you know that you are really a great person beautiful sex they love your eyes like you know something about your eyes they like they love it very much you come around each other like you know they hold you they want you they open their heart they have so much love this isn't something about someone like you know who wants to flirt with you and have really like you know a good time with you this is a person that you did you and this person open your heart like you know you you did reawaken the love in this person heart and they did this to you too after you had like you know setbacks with other relationships before in the past they open your heart very well this is reawakened feeling emotions if you haven't been feeling the love it came to you you and this person so they love you already you don't have to be really fighting or arguing about them possibly they are talking to someone else or dealing with another person it's kind of like you need to let go all of this because this is what causing your excitement because I, I saw the sun like you know in your reading before in the past now this is the negative here the negative is angry being angry upset jealous or trying to control this person you need like you know just to let go of this because you should have healed from the past because you had this problem with an ex before you should have healed this is a time for you to succeed and be happy you know because you don't want this so they want you sometimes like you know they ignore you this new person sometimes they ignore you and they want to let you go because you present your negative here so you cannot really do that you want to be happy and continue with this relationship you have to let go all of these setbacks you are protective over this person and you are waiting to see them next time I see that you're gonna see them and it will be really very good also you want a future you see the light that this is the one 
and they make you feel like you no know, younger again, happy, like you no know, pure, like like you don't have any problem or issue at all. The issue of really jealousy and not really being trusty that you need to let go. This is the only thing. Someone from your past here wants to see you and they want to renew the relationship with you. A lot of you taking the past, you know, taking the like, you know, the the ex. But I see like, you know, most of you moving forward from the past, and you want to ignore them and say like, you know, enough with the past, and you want to connect with this new love. I see that you are changing things in your life, like, you know, to make yourself really completely happy. With these changes, I see you lucky, because this is what you're supposed to be doing. And you are trying to be really settling down with someone new. This other person, like no, they are not really sure about your behavior or action at this time, like no, because they see you like no, just very strong and powerful, and they give them like no, really this very good energy, and suddenly you want to separate and you, ha you have some arguments and you feel like you know, that they broke your heart but they are not sure why they broke their, their, your heart because you feel that they are talking to someone else so there is that problem and this issue so you keep holding back on this new love you approach it, you decline it you don't know what you are doing exactly here because you feel this is not getting you anywhere you want more action from this actual person even though that you still feel the love and the connection and the beauty in it but sometimes you feel like you know, that you want to separate yourself if you act you keep acting this way this is what's going to happen you're going to end up lonely you don't want to end up lonely because you have to add like you know, your patient here and you have to trust more because look you ask too many questions you have an issue of trust. You keep like no really want to, to spy on this person or snoop around or try to know like no or trying to fish information from this person, and they don't really like no want to see you that way. So they feel like no if you are doubting yourself like that, they need to let go instead of really like no really interacting with you. This is I'm talking about the new person. You did the same thing like no with the past also. You cannot. You have to learn your lesson from what happened to you in the past. Because these issues, like, you know, destroy the relationship and made you unhappy. I'm not saying that you are the one who's wrong. Someone from your past did you wrong really very well, yes. And, and, and left, like, you know, a bad mark, like, you know, on you that way. So you have to be really, like, you no know, more opening up at this time and, uh, and listen to the other person, what they are saying to you instead of really like you know, just jumping into conclusions this way but I see good news coming to you and this person is really like you very much like you know they feel like you know even like you no know, even how old are you like you no know, even you could be 50 years old but you look like 32 maybe like you know or 35 like you, know, you look younger than your age they are amazed and surprised about it here not necessarily 50 I just gave an example they are shocked and surprised about like you know this spiritual connection between you two. The actual like you no know, really connection is really great. They can feel you. They can really think the same way like you. But when you when you start really like you know just with an issue of like you know really jealousy here, they wanna block you and shut the door on you. And they say like you know I cannot really do it until you know and understand where you are coming from and I'm not gonna chase after you you come to me like you know really pure and happy go lucky that's what they want you to do nobody can stay like you know, in this attitude really very much also because you don't want to be really keep hurting and hurting yourself and hurting the people around you by like you know not really trusting they tell you here like you, know, you are the only one and you need to believe it sweetie um, it seems to be that you are going to be really having a better timing that way. 
whoever like you know left their spouses behind here and they did not really connect with them it looks to me that you're still protective over them you did not let go from your heart you feel bad and sorry about um, not really going straight forward to understand the other person in your life it doesn't feel like you know, the blame like you no know, on one person here someone from your past did you wrong and you did something wrong also like you know that you believe that you did something wrong but you did something wrong after your ex did because you were having some doubts and you want to feel the confident in yourself if you want to be really connecting with your past it sounds to be that you have to forgive and let go all of the past like you know, issues and problems for the happiness to come to you because if you cloud yourself with so much anger you're not going to be happy very much there is no place for happiness to enter your life so you need to let go and empty free yourself from any damage that has been done to you the freedom here that when you let go like you know a lot from your heart like you know from your anger um, and not trusty and you say I forgive this person I'm not mad at them anymore I don't have any expectations you leave so much space for the happiness to come to you either way it works really best if you want to connect again with someone from from your past or if you want to proceed with the new relationship because in either way that you want to be happy so it's really better to let go a lot and let go of anger issues even if you want to take someone from your past or move to another relationship you need to let go the past all of it um, but it sounds to be that you know happiness and love is really coming to you in the coming few weeks like you know about two weeks from now you will see where is that point that make you really better understanding you need to open your your mind also to feel like you know, that people can be different sometimes and um, they raised like you know in a different culture or environment or different families they don't have to be thinking the same exactly like you you have to give them the time also the chance like you know to listen like you know, to their problems or their ideas or their opinion you cannot like you know just keep being mad and angry and it's not really a good thing but I see you like you know, enjoying the love here. I see you like you know, for some of you are going to be getting married this year, approaching marriage, and this is something marriages is going to happen so fast as soon as possible. Um, it could be three months from now. It could be like you know happening along the run like you no know, um, in a month. Um, some of you like you know, till the end of the year. Best of luck for you, dear Aries, and uh, I hope you enjoy the reading. And please, if you need a private reading, contact me on mysticalaziza.com. There is also in the description box a, a link for donation. Please send your donation, and I appreciate that very much. Thank you, and have a nice day. Bye-bye.